Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Ria. Today I'm going to test fly the Mavic Air 2. I'm going to go out to the location now and I'll catch you guys there. Today we're in the forest center. We're going to try the Mavic Air 2. We're gonna do a test flight. And I've got my nephew here today. He's gonna help me out. Hi, I am Wolfrey. So we're all ready to go now. Uh, we've got the helipad set up. We're just gonna take off and see how it goes. For the first flight, I'm going to use the auto takeoff. For that, I'm going to press the up arrow icon on the left of the screen and then press and hold the takeoff button. So now we are going to check the front obstacle avoidance system to see if it works. So I'm going to bring it close to the camera to see if it detects it and stops. You can see it's not coming forward anymore, even with the full throttle. Now I'm trying the back obstacle avoidance and yet again, we can see it's stopping at a safe distance. Time to do the speed test. The wind speed today is below average, so hopefully we should be able to hit some good numbers. So let's start with normal mode. According to the speedo on my screen, 10.9 meters per second. So that's the fastest in normal mode, which is about 39 kilometers an hour. Let's try to go even faster now using the sport mode. Bear in mind, the obstacle avoidance system doesn't work in the sport mode. So you always have to keep your eyes on the drone. Looks like 17.1 meter per second is the highest in the sport mode, which is about 61 and a half kilometers per hour. And that is quite fast for a drone at this size. Finally, let's compare the video quality. This is the D-Log, now with the color grading. And this is the HDR. I hope you have enjoyed the video and found it useful. If you did, then please don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and share it with your friends. That's it for today, guys. Stay tuned for my next video where I will be doing the Active Track 3 test and more detailed obstacle avoidance test.